as you know, being a dad ain't easy. You know, whether you're mowing the lawn or your freaking baby's screaming all night long, you need a lot of energy, and that's what I'm finding out these days. Lucky for me, today's video is sponsored by Athletic Greens. Today we're talking about AG1. Guys, I've told you about AG1 plenty of times before. It's a comprehensive and convenient way to get 75 vitamins, minerals, and whole food source ingredients. It's as easy as taking one pack, and you can either scoop it or use a travel pack like I always do. You dump it in there, give her a splash of water as much as you'd like. And guys, it's this easy to get your daily nutritions when you got AG1 around. Ready? I'm gonna chug this on video for proof. And guys, it goes without saying, you know, we don't have the most perfect diets around here. You know, we're hitting up the gas station for lunch, things like that. And AG1 helps fill those gaps in my diet. But my personal favorite attribute that I give to AG1 is it gives you a lot of energy. If you're bogging down in your afternoons, AG1, take this once a day, it'll boost you right through your afternoon. And guys, if you visit athleticgreens.com slash Cletus after the video, you get a free one-year supply of vitamin K and D and five free travel packs. Shout out to Athletic Greens for sponsoring today's video. Let's get to the live action. Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me On YouTube channel. All right, guys, we officially have the winner of the F-150. So if you haven't gotten a call and you're seeing this video, unfortunately, you didn't win the truck. But thank you to everyone who participated, got a t-shirt, a hat, whatever. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts, man. We spend all this money on these cars and this fleet and these videos. So just you guys supporting us by buying merch is awesome. And we're going to continue to do these giveaways where we don't change our prices or raise our prices or anything. You just buy our merch and it's like a bonus offer. You might get a cool vehicle. We got plenty more in store. But the winner is Spencer G and he is in Nixa, Missouri. So we're gonna call Spencer for the first time. Probably snowing there right now. Yeah. <laughs> He's probably Not like, great, I gotta go to Florida. And like I've told you guys before, we do all of our stuff through a law firm. So he already knows he won the truck because we have to verify the winner, make sure you know they fit all the rules and that and they're eligible. We do it by the book, so he does know, but we're gonna call him for the first time right now. Better not air me, dude. I'll be pissed. Hello? Spencer? Yes, sir? It's what Cletus. Cleeter? Cleeter? Yes, sir. Damn, okay, well, it's official now. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel, dude? You have won the Whipple Supercharged F-150 and 15 yeah. grand cash. I'm still, I'm still processing it. Yesterday was all the shock, you know, because I got the call and I was like, uh, I was looking to see if you had posted anything. I was looking to make sure it was legit, but now, Bro. now that I'm speaking to you, congratulations. It seems like we're headed in the right direction. It's hard to tell with all the, all the scams and stuff on the internet right I now. Know, so. That's what I was saying, because like there wasn't really much that they told me where it was like a hundred percent legit, you know. So yeah. I was kind of like. Oh, well, as long as they didn't ask you for money to verify no, that you're winning, <laughs> that's how you should know. <laughs> yeah, they did not. What's your day job? Uh, so uh, I kind of I deliver cabinets. Essentially, is delivering the, cabinets the main cool. part of it. Well, perfect. You got a pickup truck. <laughs> won't be, won't be <laughs> late. I pickup truck. Yeah, I will not be using that for delivery. <laughs> <laughs> Are you used to fast cars? Is this your first fast so, car? Um, I'm not not your kind of fast cars. Um, I have a built 03 Mustang mid 400s wheel. Nice. So okay, like cool. Fast, so you know the deal, you know, though. I'm, I'm in the scene, I guess. What did you buy off of the website? Uh, I bought two hats. Two like hats. 60 bucks. No yeah. way. Sixty <laughs> bucks, dude. <laughs> I got I got 14 entries. That's so. a crazy thing. I mean, it's completely random. So you could buy yep. a hat, a sticker, or you know, five T-shirts. It just is. Random, yeah, I so. bought that uh, that retro design like turbo hat that says Cletus on it, and Hell then yeah. one of your straw hats. So. Love it, man. Are you gonna get out of cold Missouri and come down to Florida and pick this thing up, or what? Uh, yeah, I, I plan on it. <laughs> the truck's sitting here. Sam gave her a final buff down. She's ready for you. Dude, this is crazy. <laughs> All right, well, absolutely crazy. Well, I'm gonna end off the video that we're, we're shooting a video of this right now, just so you know, so you're being cool. recorded. Cool. But um, cool. just wanted to say congrats, and I'll text you, and we'll get everything arranged so you can come down and maybe do a little burnout at the Freedom Factory before you yeah, leave. Yeah, I mean, of course, we got we got to test it out. Before <laughs> I, like, ownership. Hell yeah! Congrats, Spencer. Yeah. We'll see you around, brother. Right. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you, buddy. That's a big fire me up. I love when someone cool, I mean, the guy delivers cabinets for a living. Blue collar dude. Watches, Already a Ford guy. Dude. Watches the videos, got some hats. That's like the freaking perfect good feeling. Story.
great feeling. So many more of these to come. I'll be straight up, guys. We got some sick giveaways for 2023, so brace yourselves. But that's some awesome news right there. Let's get to the video. Man, you getting new wheels, brother? Dang, what year are them off of? You need to dial in these headlights, brother. I know. Golly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's show them the odometer on this thing real quick. Show them the odometer on Sam's truck real quick. Let's see. 730,000. 946. Getting ready to be 731. Stock engine. Phone stock. Hey, cookies, on, brother. I'll put it on your oh, these anniversary cookies. Dang. My <laughs> guy, Sam. I mean, did you buff these? <laughs> They're buffed down spray by uh, They better not scratch. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, as you know, just months ago, our pole barn blew down, landed on the toter home. Cleaning up, we didn't really worry too much about the pole barn. We we're like, dang it, that sucks because, you know, now the toter's uncovered. Well, Chambliss Steel Buildings hit me up. They're like, brother, we want to come out and set up a building for you. And listen, I paid for this building, but I got to say, this is flat out some of the best service I've ever experienced. These guys did an incredible job. Check it out. We got ourselves a brand new building. Come take a look. So as you know before, she was made of wood and it just had a, a steel roof on it. Blew right over. Not only did that building probably cost $20,000, it was here when we got it, but it cost a lot more than twenty thousand dollars to our toter home real unfortunate but here we are check this bad girl out this thing 150 mile per hour wind rated sustained so that means that's the average wind over two minutes it can take 150 mile an hour which i think around this area during hurricane Ian, we had like 130 mile an hour sustained so we were right up there this 150 this bad girl is red iron steel so that's chambliss steel buildings is the guys who did this they do pre-engineered red iron steel buildings hurricane rated walkthrough door even come on in george it's gonna be real dark in here oh not too bad look at this unit yeah. do it for dale it's got really good acoustics too Buenos dias. basically if you hit these guys up for a building you know they build the building to your zip code requirements. Dude, what a nice so obviously building. we had this concrete here too, but I wanna just continue to shout out the guys at Chambliss. They can do your concrete. They give you engineered plans, they engineer the foundation. Cause look, we obviously just had wood beams before that wasn't enough. So they dug like six feet into the ground and put these massive footers in. Look at how wide that goes. A little bit better than this four, <laughs> four inch by four inch piece of wood. So now we got these freaking massive red iron steel beams. This sucker ain't going anywhere, brother. Now, since every building's custom tailored to each job, check out this 20 foot wide door we got. So. We can still back the toter home into this unit, dude. Look at that rig. I haven't even opened it yet. <laughs> so, that's a door right there. This is so much nicer, dude. I mean, the pole barn was sweet because you could just pull stuff right under it. I mean, you guys used to see the videos where we'd have like 20 cars parked up under here. But it cost almost the same to put metal on the, the outside of it. I mean, we're talking a small amount of money to go a little bit further and just enclose it. So now we can store everything inside, it's all locked up. No one can just pull up and get in Rodney and chuck the rods out of it. You know what I mean? Cause we used to leave the keys in Rodney all the time. Still do. Obviously that's the only car someone would steal if they came here. <laughs> so it's like the jet boats and everything, you know, they still get a lot of sun on them in the pool bar and the toter home, everything now, it's all closed in, but we have to christen the building by doing a burnout right now. This guy is literally insane. White trash or Rodney, I understand, but the Porsche? <laughs> Dude, you done kicked out some dust in here. It Got sounds so good. 
Yeah, it fits like a glove. So nice to have it out of the way. Oh man, dude, this thing, the floor stainer 9000 needs to be moved to the new shop. You walked out there yet, Jackson? We went, we went Sucker's serious, there, dude. dude. Just this look one, at I, it. I think the quote is, this is what dreams are made of. Yeah. What do you think we should do for a mural? Oh, I'm thinking a big old screaming bald eagle. <laughs> like something you'd see airbrush on the back of a Harley guy's helmet. There she goes. There she is. Clutch. Foot slipped over there. It's the automatic cars. I thought I was pushing the clutch. I was pushing the <laughs> throttle. Oops. <laughs> Free. <laughs> in the building had to go back around in part probably all the smoke dude we are gaining our room back Woo! Hey, oh <laughs> bro why you got a mouse trap on the seat dude, look at someone bo booby trapped you right there what's that some cheese on there easy does it oh, easy yeah. does it george oh. rattlesnake oh. <laughs> come on down bro I like that wide door, dude. It's prime. You can drift right into it, you know what I mean? <laughs> Freedom Force One. All right, guys. Well, the real moment of truth of whether this building was worth it or not is if that fits in here by backing it in to this 20-foot wide door. 
because we used to have the whole you know end of the building open now we only have 20 feet and this is a big trailer and there's not a ton of room so you kind of got to cut it around this turn hopefully it's wide enough that was the theory when we set it up Oof, winch right there tight squeeze dude that's a big trailer that's what you call a big rig right there bud up on the wall up there yep 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 nice and tight there you go skeeter come on now Oh, a little premature. Just like love. Oh, there he goes, dude. There he goes, dude. Nice load. Yeah, I hear you. <laughs> Beautiful. go through the footage i'm gonna uh get us some yellow paint paint some tire on it. <laughs> it out put some instructions on the dash we'll be good but now dude inside out of the elements safe you know she got hit by the elements and that's the reason now she's out of the elements hurricane rated hear that bad girl she's hurricane rated you don't gotta worry now so plus we're getting electrical ran to this thing so we'll be able to just plug this thing in before we had extension cords ran across the parking lot it's gonna be official. We just need some lights and we're yep. out. So it's looking pretty good. Shout out to Chambliss for the new building. Pretty excited. You know, they did a really good job setting this thing up. I mean, you guys saw how fast that happened. Really happy. And uh, shout out to the winner of the F 150, Spencer, dude. Big day for him. And guys, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Do it for Dale. We'll freaking see you later.